Hi, Lorraine Menza here, and in this video blog, I'm going to talk to you about affirmations or affirmations. Which one do you use? Well, pretty much a lot of people know what an affirmation is, but in case you don't, I will go through that with you. An affirmation is a positive statement we use on projecting on what we want to be, what we want to see happen in our lives. For example, I am successful, or I am losing weight. Are I, they are I am statements, something that you foresee happening in your life that you want to see happen. An affirmation is not, it's not a positive statement, it's a question, it's, it's formed in a question. Now the difference between an affirmation and an affirmation is this, affirmations are, um, are something that your brain, your mind can question. They can say, well, you're not rich, you're not successful, or, you know, they'll ask why. Your brain is constantly asking why. This is according to Noah St. John, who's written the book of affirmations. He explains why affirmations do not work for him. And affirmations are on a, on a subconscious level, your brain wants to, it kind of sabotages you. So it asks questions. So you need to ask questions to, your, to yourself so that your brain, your subconscious, can start answering them. So you can say, why am I so successful? Or why am I losing weight? And that way your brain can go ahead and start, you know, while you're sleeping and all this is going on and you've asked those questions, it starts thinking about that and trying to get answers to those questions. In other words, it starts putting the positive actions in, um, that you need into place. It's starting to give you answers to these, which is, um, which is a good thing actually. So now, which one to use? Well, I guess it depends if you really do question your affirmation. Do you really believe that you're going to become successful? Do you really believe you're going to lose weight? Or do you kind of like in a, a subconscious level or in another level, you kind of are questioning it yourself? If you are, you got to change your affirmation to an affirmation and question it so that your brain can answer, try to answer it for you. Question and say, okay, well, why is that true? I'm going to start finding the answers for you. So hopefully I explained the differences to you and you can find which one works well for you. And with that said, hopefully, hopefully you found value. If you did, click like, uh, subscribe, share, leave a comment and click on the link below to find out why I joined this business. <laughs> Take care. Have a great day.